Probably lost to Ben, I'm lucky. They've traded set. I should, shouldn't say traded sets. Ben's definitely won the majority of them, but Corey has taken a set off from this season. Ben, big step up this season. Trying to, I don't know if he's trying to make PR, but he's he's looking pretty good for it. I, I don't really keep up with stats anymore, but just, just, just a hunch, just off my knowledge of how the community is right now. I would say it's, it'd be very, it'd see it'd be, it'd be saying Wumpy's going pallet just to make it go faster because it's, it's getting late. But uh, it is just funny because <laughs> it would be hilarious if Cory won. Okay, can I see an edge guard? No, okay. Cory being very patient, both of them being patient there. Neither of them pulled the trigger. It's scary here getting platform pressure by, by Palutena. A lot of multi hits. Uh, different timings to deal with between there and up air. Very even right now. I don't know about going off stage there, because now you're in the corner against Palo. It worked out, so what do I know? Good up tilt, rage up tilt taken there, like 130. And uh, I was going to say, as long as you're not in the corner. Okay, I'm pretty sure down throw back here is not true on Bowser at kill percent. I know it's true on, I think, K rule and I think DDD, I think. There's not many heavies it's true on anymore at kill percent. Wow, I'm very surprised that grab missed. He just was, he was just nowhere, like, I don't know how that crossed up. There's some interesting interactions in this game because there's no um, there's no body or there is body blocking, but it's weird because when you're invulnerable, there's none of them. So there are some interesting interactions where you can see cross-ups that you don't necessarily think are going to happen. Ooh, ledge! Oh, I guess the footstool. That was actually really cool. And the ledge trump bear. Now he's. I think I'm in the pallet discord. I'll check later. I'll check later. They have a chart for it with the updated um, down throw. Yeah, I was going to say that down air is terrible because Palo up air should get chew through it. I actually really don't like that option. I don't think it's that good. Nice combo here. Should be at about 50, 60. Surprised it didn't hit. Totally would have died to it. Nair, nair to back throw. Interesting combo you never see, but it works. Four with a nice lead. Not anything insane. Definitely definitely pretty easy for Pallor to rack up this damage. Okay. Good side view there. The up the down air was unsafe. That's a game. <laughs> the down air was unsafe. He totally could have upbeat it, but he instead went for the, the harder punish with the side view. So he had to read him shielding after the, uh, the down air. Going into game number two. Again, it would be very ironic if Corey won after what Mr. B said. Uh, I used to use a lot of Discord, like just uh, in in them just to see random shit. Never use them, I'm just in them. I gotta make sure I got my keys on me. I, I do not see keys down here. He was sitting here. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, Butter Dog lost his keys. He cannot get into his house now. He's sitting in the cold. Wish him luck. Game number two, big lead here for a big start here from Wampy, I should say. Nice little quick 50. Again, it's one of those things. Bowser's the heavy. They spawn at 60. Not a big deal. It's just as long as you can avoid meaningful hits. Although getting rinse repeated, I will say, is very annoying as a heavy. Not a good feeling. Again, I don't really like... Well, it worked out. I was going to say, I don't really like the Bowser bomb option there. It's, I think it's a little too committal. But it worked out because he ended up getting the border. Anyway. Now you have a Rage Bowser against a Death Percent Palu. Ooh, good up smash. Good, correct option. Barely didn't work. It caught the spot dodge anyway, but it didn't kill. All right, that down air. Again, very committal, but it worked out. Rage up tilt, what a move. I will say, Bowser up tilt is definitely a move that I think most characters, like, never talk about. Definitely a move I think most characters love to have with their kid. Bowser up tilt is just so quick and just such a big anti-air while also reading rolls. Like, it, it does so much for his kid, and it kills stupid early. Especially when you jump into it, because then you're already at uh, like full hop height. So that lead evaporated, and now it's going to be probably two hit combo. Good tomahawk neutral air there. Down air, 
Wouldn't have killed there, but I don't. Again, if it's not gonna kill, why even go for the option? That's kind of the way I see it. May, may, it might have. He was at 40, I guess. Won't be doing a good job. Good teleport cancel, but Corey actually gonna punish it with the new flare. Oh, that up, I'm telling you, that up tilt. Oh, it didn't hit. That up smash, super punish on the teleport cancel. Oh, I was gonna say, what is up? Hey there, lovely guys. We are here. We're in there. Uh, good up smash there by Wompy because it covers Nucci get up really well. Ooh, good air dodge read. Not gonna kill though. Corey's recoveries are nuts. And yeah, uh, Wompy recovering. has not played against him that often, so I don't know if he knows that. He's recovering very well all, all day today, actually. He's been kind of on time. Usually he does. If he's playing really bad, he won't. But his recoveries are usually, like, yeah. on point. There's just so much mix to it. That's what makes it good. But Wompy with a small lead here. Nothing insane. Slowly building now. That guy got a flash up there. Is that little track? Oh. Okay. He's cooking. Yeah, I was going to say, the issue with going high... Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> the, I was going to say, the issue with going high is the fact that it's so laggy that you can definitely punish it. Yeah, it's one one right now. Corey's a lot better at playing in both games. Yeah, he's. <laughs> it was a problem for us tonight. Yeah, I was going to say, lost pretty early in quarters and then has made it all the way back to Grands. Yeah. Which, you know, he, he's. it's one of those things. He is not great. Oh, it is a bit, but he does not great a lot of the time, but then randomly he just kind of shows, like, oh, yeah, I can still play. And I'm happy he can do that because sometimes it goes on a streak long enough where I'm like, is bro washed? I can't, I can't tell. <laughs> Ashley. Grab the setup numbers. Going min min, I have. Uh, it's, I'm not sure how. I have done nothing about this matchup. I was going to say it's. I get why. His min min was playing good against, against Brandon. So I get why he's going min min. I feel like you get Palo off stage with two frame timing, then you can probably, you know, fuck up pretty bad. Yeah, you have to you have to be able to punish the, the high uppies. Not just legitimately going high and landing yeah. a platform, but also the invulnerable ones. If he lands yeah, on stage. Exactly, yeah. I mean, if he grabs ledge from above it, it's invulnerable. Which is, again, it's. Why? <laughs> Why do they do that for teleports? I don't know, it's weird. It's just random. They got not letting Wampy get that free movement there. Oh, jumping. Okay. That. I always say that when Palo's throwing an F tilt on a platform, 100% of misinput is one of the worst misinputs you can do because the animation's like a second long. And then you suck on the platform stuff. Yeah, yeah, you end up but getting punished. It worked, it worked. It was definitely intentional. It worked. Yeah, Corey jumped into it. He said, all right, buddy, I'll let you hit one. Uh, Very big move. And Ooh. you picked the, maybe the Ooh, worst option you could out. do because you're playing against Palo, brother. You can't land on that. It's like when people like Game Watch up the on their shield. Like, that was a good, good Yeah, acknowledgement. Right. I was going to say, it's, it's, it's exactly. Oh, it's and against Palo, you also don't want to do that. Huge damage here. <laughs> Taking no 60. Jump. No jump, yeah. Oh, good stall. Ooh. Really good stall, actually. That's smart. It was less committal than using an air dodge. And it also left him with an air dodge, too. So if he needed to, he could use it again. Oh, my god. Yeah, Corey's not letting him uh, get away with that uh, ledge cancel there. Like, not even once. Uh, see, that's what sucks. It's like he's in the corner. He didn't have a jump. He air dodge. And he's, he barely missed timed it. It's min min. That's where you, exactly where you want uh, power to be. Yeah, oh, great laser there, calling out the side B. Dude, I'm not sure why I you in side B there? To be honest, like, it's not gonna reach center stage. It's probably a habitual thing where it's like a lot of people that have B buttons, they, they just go for it. You know what I mean? When they're off stage, you see it a lot. <laughs> like, that's not like think of any zone you've ever played versus they, they just kind of shoot stuff. Actually, you know what? Yeah. <laughs> Whether it's good or not, you, you play Link. You probably got it. Yeah, yeah, I get what you're saying. Boomerang. Yeah, exactly. And then you get punished. You're like, why do I do that? Why would I do? Yeah. It's often stuff. Bobby Wasabi jump side being from ledge. Yep. That's good. 100. percent Ooh, should not get back here. Yeah, he should. He's gonna say one piece should be dead here. Yep. This is what sucks. It's such a rinse repeat, and if you fuck it up, it's just. Yeah. Oh, if you fuck it, it up, it's. Okay. All right, didn't matter. No, no. Wait, 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 wait. It's not over yet. Okay, now it is. I was gonna say that because that, that's a shitty situation where like you get the rinse repeat, it should be the freest thing, and then you mess it up, and it's like, oh, now I gotta play neutral again. All right, well, we are one game away from Corey resetting. Playing insane today in both games. Playing very well. A lot of game fives for Corey. Um, oh, go Corey. Uh, I was gonna say I think Wampy might be switching. Nope. 
he's really gonna re if he resets for the skin, I swear to God. No, no, no. He was picking his skin. He was oh, okay, 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 okay. I was gonna say. I thought he was telling Wompy like, I need to change my skin. I was gonna say, dude, just just play it. Like, <laughs> it's not that big of a deal. Because Vidman was further down the uh, further down the roster, it takes longer to load the skins. <laughs> so funny. Oop. Oh right, I was God. gonna say that forward air could have yeah. been dangerous. Yeah, actually, I was gonna say if he crosses up the neutral, I don't think Pal. I mean, uh, Mimin can do anything about it. I don't think she has an out of shield option. Maybe, maybe Nair, but I doubt it. Uh. If you get the parry. It'd be rising there, so you're not going to get too much. Yeah, I'm just saying, just to get a punch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just to make it not safe, you know what I mean? I like that dash attack. I don't like that down air. There you and go. Solar's jump should be should be easy. Yeah, I was going to say. Yeah, I want to see Wampy uh, get a little more sneaky underneath the uh, corner. Put a little stink on that Ooh. F smash. Knew exactly where Wampy was going to land. Okay, that down there wasn't that bad because he put him himself in an awkward position where you couldn't really read him before he jumped nice. in. So. Yeah, that's a re-grab. I know Wampy has been really focusing on Banjo over Palu, but um, it makes you really think that if you're down to one like this, how bad is that matchup going to be? Well, it's, he was going Palu versus Bowser, too. And I, again, I, I know nothing about Bowser Banjo. I'm just... I don't know. Cause he, his, their... They, I feel like they pick their characters almost on random. Because, like, sometimes they go Banjo, sometimes they go Bowser. I mean, Palu, sometimes the entire day, like today, is pretty, pretty much all, as far as I know, all Banjo, and then Palu for Banjo. the last bit, yeah. So I don't know. Because they definitely, I think they beat Cory with Banjo the last time. Mm. They're definitely winning right now, I'll say that much. Yeah. That's that, that destroys. Yeah. yeah. I was going to say, that. Absolutely yeah, destroys uh, tethers. Right to game five. That was a swift. Too bad for you. Well, of course, we're staying. I would stay. I think. I think I would stay. It's Corey, though. Corey, bro, let's go, Corey. You know what? That's so true for me. It's so real. Yeah, I assume it's terrible for for Banjo, but. Yeah, it sounds terrible for Banjo. Yeah, he's yeah, so back. Game five, same stage, different character. Juan Pablo gaming. The thing is, this matchup is definitely like you know it's playable. It's just power favor. It's nothing insane, it's but it's, but it's <laughs> but if you do get killed early and Palo is a big lead, it sounds not fun at all. Because hitting Palo with Bowser seems pretty annoying. It's, it, again, you just have to be, you have to know where the Palo is going to be to get the punish. You get the speed. You get the speed to get there. She's getting there. Yeah, it's just the frame data of actually like, clicking a button. I know they want to be expecting the, uh, be there. Good Tomahawk there. Yeah, going high. Very small punish. Not, nothing big. Just taking a home. Still no reset to neutral, though. Nice. I like that. Grab. I like that. Ooh, I'm surprised Ooh. I didn't go for the neutral air up tilt there. Yeah, uh, I think that was close. Yeah. I don't, it would definitely want to kill because it's Bowser, but it's still good damage. Up tilt does a lot of fucking damage. Yeah. Recover? All right. Wow, waited up the whole cutscene there and still got side B. I was going to say, like, won't be definitely a little too patient there. Yeah, respecting a little too much. Doing a good job mixing up the teleport cancels. And Corey's doing a great job. Cancels. Oh, you overextended a little bit. You did a great job not overextending for a while. Wow. I don't like those down airs. I keep saying it. One of these days, Wumpy's going to get the punish. That's bad stale. Okay. Yeah, see? Man, like I said, definitely going to put you in a position that's not advantageous. Oh, dude, I Ooh. hate that. It's not good, but like when you get hit by it's it. It's flashy, it's, though. Yeah, it's flashy <laughs> when you get hit by it. It's awful. So I'd be having miserable range. Thank God. Here. Thank God. Oh, I don't know if Wumpy wanted a full Humpy up there. <sighs> it's present Packer didn't hit. He read the spot dodge and everything, and it barely didn't hit. I want people to big. This is exactly what I was talking about. If, yeah. if Palo takes the lead, like Bowser has to. Uh, this should be dead though. You say that, but like, oh, wow. you just fucking fist bump the. If they teleport from above the ledge, it's invulnerable. Oh right. You don't yeah. have a two frame. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. Which means you have to commit going off stage and then probably miss and get reversal, which is also awful. I like that. Okay. I, I do. I do. And, and unfortunately, he barely missed. Uh, the neutral air punish there. Good 
recovery. Deep edge guard here from Wompy, but barely missing it. Alright, good read there from Wompy. Realize before he's going to try to up be high. And getting the Nair, making a big lead right now. See, this is what sucks too, is that like, do you play passive as Bowser and just try to slowly whittle the lead back after taking 60, or do you try to go balls to the wall and go for crazy, crazy Better reads? Yeah, back just just have a one. jump. No jump, yep. That's, that's just... Okay, you know what? I mean, you don't have a jump, like, just down you gotta do something. Yeah, ping dong, yep. Yeah. This should be it. Wow, Corey's recoveries are crazy today! But he's, he's still also, gonna die, but yeah, like, he's, still I was gonna say, he's buffering, cr crazy he's buffering ledge off really quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's gonna be that it. Wampy sending us home. Uh, Wampy taking it 3-2. Solid stuff. Did Cory DQ from HDR? Cory did, 